So this is lesson six, number three. Still with the same objective, which is to find the total volume of solid figures composed of two non-overlapping rectangular prisms. So how is this drawing different from the last one? Yeah, this time there actually are two boxes stacked on top of each other. The last time we just kind of imagined one, right? So we have a bigger box on the bottom and a littler box stacked on top. Now, there are a lot of markings on this figure, so we're going to need to be careful that we use the right ones to find the volume. Okay, so what I want you to do is I want you to try and find the volume of this by yourself. And what you can do is you can pause this. You can use tap tap blocks. So if you know that the bottom box is six by five by four, you can make that one. Um, and then you'll need to make sure that you know the volume of, so the bottom is six by five by four. And then the top box is three by four by three by four and then by two. Okay, so you can use tap tap box to find the total volume or you can draw this in, um, in a notebook. But I want you to try and find this volume by yourself. When you are done, come on back, unpause the video and see how you did. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to find the volume of the bottom box, like I just told you. And with the volume of the bottom block, the bottom box, we're going to write in blue. So we have 6 times 5 times 4. Length times width times height. So 6 times 5 is 30 times 4 is 120. And it's not just 120. It is 120 cubic inches. We're working in inches, right? So 120 cubic inches. That's the bottom box. Now we're going to do the top box in green. So the top box is 3 inches long. 3 inches by 5 inches wide by two inches tall. So we have three times five times two. Three times five is 15 times two is 30 inches cubed. So 30 inches cubed or 30 cubic inches. And then now what do we have to do in order to find the total volume of them both? Great, we have to add them together. So we have 120 inches cubed, cubic inches, and then plus 30 cubic inches, which gives us a grand total for the whole thing of 150 cubic inches. 